Hey guys, welcome to the vault. Um, we are back with some more exclusive content today. We're talking the Sweetheart Collection um, by Hat Club. You guys excited? Ooh. Gosh, I've never been quite this giddy for a, <laughs> for for anything in my life. I mean, you know, this harkens me back to the day of the Red Velvets, mm -hmm. um, when mm -hmm. uh, Richard Jenick uh, sent me uh, some pictures of them, and I was like, uh, I don't know, maroon with pink bottom. I was like, I don't know about this. Um, and those ended up just blowing up, right? Like people are still through. asking for them. Yep, they blew out the original stock. Then they ended up doing a restock or, or a pre-order, right? And those things, those things were pretty popular. I mean, those hats were fantastic. And Leon, mm -hmm. luckily as a Toronto fan, got one of the best uh, with Toronto. That I was great. Originally, I had to get it on uh, pre-order. Yeah, you weren't uh, you weren't connected back then. <laughs> I got LA back then. Oh, LA, yeah, LA, yeah. yeah. LA is LA is easy to get though. Cause there's so many of them, but, yeah. but listen, the, these, these, I think we're going to be, sh we're, we're going to be wowed by um, because um, from what I've seen so far, they're, they're, they're pretty good looking. So let's dig in. Let's take a look. Good. So um, we got to talk about the video that they put out, right? That was a pretty good video. Did you guys, did you guys watch the, the kind of like music video they threw together with all the couples mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. With, the, with the turntable and stuff? Yeah, that was pretty cool. Yeah. Right? Yeah. They went, yeah, they went a little uh they went a little um packer, packer shoes-ish with some of these hats, right? Mm -hmm. You guys yeah, notice yeah. that? Yeah. I bet in the brims looking like a, the, the pre-curve. Looking like they might have gotten damaged in a little makeout session. Maybe. <laughs> they definitely didn't off of some of them. They definitely didn't watch your uh, curve uh tutorial. No, because these aren't these aren't really good curves. But Leon, yeah. let me ask you a question, man. Let's say you're about you're about to embark on a big makeout session, right? You take the hat off or you hat's keep it on. Off. Yeah, that a boy. Brim's getting in the way, man. You gotta That's turn right. it backwards, bro. Nah. You gotta you gotta That's Jason Mead. That's why oh. Jason Mead has his turn back. He's so used My to wife his is younger days. Yeah, right quick. <laughs> with me, so I gotta be ready. At all times. Mead's me, yeah, and I mean, I'm sure that's gonna be the case on the on uh, on Valentine's Day. So, oh, you know it. You came you came prepared. <laughs> But well, I've been uh, married like twenty years, so yeah. Yeah, but that 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 fire never dies when you got a man like Mead hanging around. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> so we got all right. So this is really two stages to this, right? You've got the reds and you've yep. got the maroons, right? Yeah. Yes. Yep. Red and pink and, and maroon and infrared. Yeah. Are you guys ready? So we'll it doesn't down... really look infrared to me, but maybe it's just because of the pictures. But yeah. I guess maybe a little bit, but yeah. It kind of just looks That's red. Just, it looks red. Yeah, it looks red. But I, I don't, I, you know, I think Listen, I like the darker ones more. Infrared is a is a funny, funny color because yeah. if you can look at it one day and it looks like hot pink, the next time it looks yeah. like a light, light red. It looks like a pink. Yeah. It's it's sometimes such a it looks weird orange. Sometimes it's weird. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a very odd color depending on what it's paired up with. Right. Yeah. No doubt. Yeah. All right. Let's dig in here. So we're gonna get deeper looks at these. Oh, for, first oh. things first. Oh. Ooh. So Ooh. usually they a mandatory add-on. Yeah, usually they reserve um, pins for pre-orders, but they didn't do it this time. So there is going to be a little bit of a price hike, five dollars, but you do get the pin included. And don't don't that? don't make out with that pin on either. That thing looks fucking dangerous. That's a brooch. That that will poke your. The big pin. Good. It's a big ass pin. It's a it's cool not a bad pin. looking. Yeah, it's pin. a nice it's pin. Not a bad looking pin. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. I think it's dope. I feel like it adds a nice touch to it too. Um, I don't know. I feel like the red really pops up. It, I feel like the pins look really good on the dark one. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. A lot yeah. of good contrast. But getting back to like, do what, do I like the fact that they're adding to the price with this? No. Yeah, I don't think that's fair. But 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 for five bucks for that big of a pin, that's actually a, a decent price compared to what some of them are going for. It's yeah, yeah price, I mean, I'm not but, disagreeing with that, but it's it's not a choice. You know what I mean? Yeah, right, like, yeah. If you grab yeah, five, one thing if you had the option to buy it or to not buy it, and it just not be, you know. But I, I mean, it is what it is. Because you might want one, but you may not yeah. want five. Right, right, right. Yeah. That's what I'm getting at, man. But I, for me, man, when I'm doing my family photos, right, I want one on each, so I'm okay with it. But I know some of the more price conscious people are gonna be like, "Listen, keep your goddamn pin. Give me my five bucks." Yeah, yeah, yeah. I could see a few people kind of be frustrated about that. But I yeah. mean, in all reality, though, I guess it's because it's 50. It's free shipping after 50, right? Yeah. So you're right. Yeah, that's a good so point. technically it's just the same price you would normally be paying then. 
Unless you're buying like the quantities I buy. Correct. Yeah. Unless you're buying multiples. Yeah. Then that's so, so these are going to be sitting right at 50. Yeah. Right. Yep. Yep. Yeah. 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 I like the pin. I personally don't like that additional cost. And I, I kind of know how much these cost to make. So, I mean, I know Leon does too. So it's not like, yeah, you know, I mean, but at the end of the day, it's a business. So like, I just think there should be an option. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, yeah, yeah, I get it. I get it, though. They're not being I, aggressive with it, though. I mean, no, five, they're, they're not. Yeah, yeah, they're it's not. Five bucks. Yeah, I get it. I mean, the pin is a dope upgrade. I mean, to be honest with you, at, right, especially at this like day and age, I kind of feel like if they did that more often, people probably would buy pins. You know, like they probably would buy a, a cookies and cream pin or whatever the situation. Oh, you know, they would. Exactly. So it also I'm, fights against um, companies borrowing their stuff, right? So you know yeah. it's from them if you got their pin too. So that that's facts. Their, yeah, that's true. Their case a little bit. So you know it'll be All interesting right. if they move forward. You know, keep doing it. I mean, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Well, let's dig in. So we talked about the pin. I'll dig into the real, the real good stuff here. Mm. The Reds. This is all of them, right? No. Yeah. Oh. We got three pages of this. Of the Reds. Oh, yeah. The Reds. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. There's, there's 30, 35 total hats in this entire drop so wow Jeez. big big drop tomorrow see my yeah. initial my initial um let's let's all pick our favorite on this slide why don't we do that my my favorite on this slide um and it's not gonna be a popular choice is the raise um i, like I, the raise. I, I really like that one it's it's down to that one um or the tigers for me so i'm gonna go with the tigers uh, I love that spring training logo. Leon, what are you at? Um, I'm I'm hosting, so the two on the right I can't see. So which two are on the right? The, the Cardinals, Cardinals Lovebirds, and the, okay, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So the 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 white tiger gotta have it. Um, mm -hmm. That one is like a. Six. I'm calling that the strawberry quick tiger. <laughs> That's the Siegfried and Roy, you know, the the date night uh, one, and then the yeah the the Cardinals. The, the two the two lovebirds mm -hmm. um yeah those are my two i like the baltimore too all right let's move to the next slide let's take a look let's let's get a good look at all these all right yeah there's some good ones here too mm -hmm. that phillies to me man that phillies is a banger um, yeah I, I, i'm yeah. not the biggest pink and red guy but that phillies is different i like that shit a yeah. lot I think on this slide, what's your favorite, Jason? I'll go back, Liam. Uh, I mean, boy, it's a tough one. Uh, because I'm a Braves fan, I'm gonna go with the Braves, but that Cubs is really nice too. The ball, I, I will say this too: the Brooklyn is fire. The Brooklyn is fire. ah, that's the one I don't like. You know why? The Ebbets big patch. ass patch. I can't stand that Ebbets Field patch. It's one of the worst side patches I've ever seen. You don't like stadium patches, though. I'm, I'm no, not no, no. I do like some. That I, get, I, I feel that though. It's a big dookie ass patch, but I mean, <laughs> it's it's dope. I, I I feel like if you like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't. It's just yeah. one of those things. Like I don't mind it, but you I 100 percent understand why somebody wouldn't like it. You, you know sold I mean? me on the Phillies one. I think the Phillies one might be might be the best in the collection it might be bro the phillies and the cardinals are gonna be the two that if people don't get they're gonna regret i don't know why but mm -hmm. it just that for me i really like the cardinals the moment i saw it i was like wait that logo is not that common and it's on a red hat i feel like you don't usually get you don't i feel like you don't see that all red hat that often with that logo on it no you know what so you know what's weird though is like I like that one. I, that's one I'm going to grab. But I think the things that Sports World put out lately with that logo have kind of have kind of like spoiled me because spoiled you, yeah. I honestly think the three from Sports World are better. But thematically, this one makes a lot of sense. Right. Yeah. And yeah. and I don't even disagree with what you're saying about that. I just don't have those hats to myself so it's it, it's easier for me to say you know what i mean just because i'm from the outside looking in if i have those hats though i could 100 understand why that might be just a mundane design you know what you know, though i'm actually wrong i'm actually wrong guys that's not the same logo because the one that no. sports world's using is from the 30s is the older one yeah so, yeah, yeah, yeah 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 all right it is so, different it's similar but yeah, I, I, I stand corrected 
All right. So my favorite on this, my Leon, I don't know if you shared yours. My favorite is uh, on this slide is probably Philly. How about you? Uh, I really, the, anytime Atlanta uses the Hank Aaron patch, I know I pushed Justin really hard to use that one. So I'm going to go with Atlanta. How do you feel about the Cubs? I like it. Mm -hmm. Cubs is okay. Yeah. You know, I think on these red and pinks, I think the ones that look the nicest are either have the white logos or the, or have the white outline on the logos just to kind of separate the pink from the red. Yeah. Agreed. All right. Let's take a look at the next slide guys. Oh, this is a winter slide. That's for sure. Well, that Orioles, this is the second time we're seeing the Orioles, right? Yeah, I think the Pirates, too. And the and Arizona. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I yeah. don't know. I, I think um, the Skull Chief, I, I'm Skull, I love the Skull Chief, but I'm like, ah. He's been used a lot lately, right? Like, yeah. Like, they have access to a plethora of, like, logos now, especially now with, like, Clink Room um, mm -hmm. 2.5, basically. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, you know. I think they can give Skull Chief a little bit of a rest. I know it sells well. I know people think they, they can't get enough of it, but, you know, mix in some stuff. That'd be pretty cool, right? I like the Mariners one here. Yeah. That one's I like okay. The, I like the Mets then, one too, man. The Mets why. one I was going to say. The Mets one I feel like might be a sleeper hat. That's a good one. I feel like that might not be one that everybody picks. And I'm not going to lie to you. You might hate me. You might hate the me. Front, the heart at the front? Are you going to say it? I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. you were thinking it, goddamn it. No, that I was thinking you were gonna say it. Like I normally <laughs> am just like, you know, I don't like the heart like that, bro. But the white logo, it's not the worst. It it I don't know. It's it's not nah, that that's bad. a good look. That's a good looking hat. Man. I mean it's a it's good, a good looking, hat. looking hat. I probably wouldn't buy it, but like it's a good hat, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's not I mean, the heart, that the heart at least years. makes sense in this collection. In this collection, yes. Yeah. It's something they've done for years, so I think that's yeah. kind of a throwback to, to like the pre uh, Red Velvet days. Yeah, um, I mean, if the logo was any other color, I would hate it. Yeah, I would yeah. hate it. But the the it works with just the white because it kind of just looks like a red LA hat. You know what I mean? But then with the pink, it kind of ties it all together a little. I, it works for me. But yeah, anytime they do the Jolly Roger, though, I think it's it's like a. a uh, I don't like this one. No. No, I'm not mad at you, bro. I'm not. I'm kind of more mad at myself. You know what I mean? For <laughs> I, I still think it's a guy to buy. I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. There's much. I think there's much better uh, hats in this collection than that one. I agree. I agree. I agree. He's got I the agree. pink bandana on and everything. I don't know. I don't know, man. You love that. I mean, teach their own. Like, that's what yeah. you love it, man. I, yeah. I have I have an awful lot of that stuff. So I'm like, all right, you know. Yeah. I mean, we keep seeing if we keep seeing it, then maybe. Yeah. But. We're almost there. We're the pro there. listen, can I just share the problem with that before we move on to the next slide? Sure. Is the side patches, there's not a lot of variety yeah. that you can use. So it's always that. And that side patch isn't necessarily that great. No. Yeah. Even even the one with the skyline's not great. No. Um is it is it too much pirate though? If they go double pirate for you? Yes. 59 with that one. It's too much, right? Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't oh, yeah, yeah, it doesn't yeah. seem to match either. It's a yeah. different kind of pirate. Different eras too. Yeah, it doesn't I don't like that. All right, let's take a look at the next one, guys. I think we're into maroons now. Yeah, these I was. Uh, I'm liking these, man. So, so the undervisor definitely looks infrared. Now it does. Pictures. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I like these. Yeah, there's a couple good ones on here for sure. Um, See, I'm, I almost feel like it's too much infrared, though, on certain ones. Like yeah, I feel socks, that. Like the white yeah, socks. you know, again, I, I think I'm liking the ones with the white border. Um, yeah, see, yeah, the white, you're right. The white, so you're right, Jason. It looks better because it has that delineation. But yeah. um, the white socks one is like the side patches. It's, it's too much infrared. I agree with that. That's kind of what I was looking at. I was like, yo, what? Is that the all-star game patch? I think it's Comiskey. The Comiskey 75, I think. Okay, okay. okay. Because I'm like, man, that is like mm -hmm. a lot. But see... The other ones, like you said, with the white, they look good. I think the Rockies looks really good, to be honest with yeah, you. Yeah, I, I, I honestly do, too. I, I don't yeah, know. Like, a lot of white I, in that patch. I really I like look, everything on this page except for the, the white socks. 
Yeah. Um, I think Texas would have been better with a different pack. Is it Texas in the corner? Yeah. 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 That's one of the better World Series patches, though. Yeah, but it's in, a, in, in the regular that. colors. In the yeah, regular. regular color, sure. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I like the Blue Jays here. I like the Red Sox. I like Colorado. Blue Jays got a different, like, that's like an alternate logo. So that's like yeah. an updated logo with the baseball. You very rarely see that. And mm-hmm. then the 40th anniversary patch, you don't really see them play with it too much. So um, the Blue Jays got to come home. Um, the Red Sox, that that's the, is that the 18? That's 2018. Yeah, yeah. So you don't really see that one get played with too often. So that's pretty cool to see that. I'm sure Pierre's excited about that one. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Nah, these are good. These are good, man. Yeah, it's good. good They're cool. And then one more page of this. Once All right, let's, ready. Let's, let's take a look. The bull snuck in there. Larry will be. The bull for, snuck in there. For, oh. for, uh, maybe it's because you're the ox. Maybe. Maybe, but keep just keep that Larry. So everybody to, just throw that Larry on. O'Brien patch away. Yeah, I'm all good. Patch is that. not for me. Yeah, I'm all I'm like, all good. I'm all good on that hat, man. Yeah, I'm all good on that hat. Could be a Chinese mm. New Year hat though. I'm kind of thinking about it. I now. will say though, that Anaheim, that Angels one, that's pretty nice. I don't mind that one. I know we slagged the. Uh, the too much infrared, but for some reason, I really like that Yankee hat. I don't know what it the, is. The Yankee one is a good one. Too. I think it's the pop pink in the patch. That's what I was going to say. I think the Sox one that kills it is the patch is just so red. That LA one, too, the 1959 World Series at the bottom with the mm-hmm. pink ball, that's good looking, too. Yeah. Yeah, that's not bad. Yeah, I, I like you know, I, I honestly don't even, I mean, like, I probably wouldn't buy it, but I. It's not bad to me, but even the San Fran one, I think the the thing with the red logos is not that bad, but the, it's that white in the patch, though. It gives it enough, like, all right, mm-hmm. you know, at least it's got something different on it. I think for um, that Sox one, though, it just kind of – that was a lot. That was a lot of red in it. Do but I don't scream, mind the Yankee, though. Do these scream Valentine's Day, too, though? These ones don't necessarily have to be Valentine's Day hats. These are just good-looking hats. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I think it's the pin. You know, with the pin, it kind yeah, of with the pin, sense. yeah. With the pin, yeah. it's obvious. Yeah. Right? But looking at these without it, like you wouldn't really assume that these are Valentine's Day. I would think the fur. I would think the red with the pink more the so. Red and the pink pink's definitely are, yeah. But these yeah, are that, these are these are pro- these to me are better though. Yeah, I like the maroon and infrared better than the. I mean, the red and pinks are great, but I think I like these maroon and infrared ones better. I like yeah, that. That Houston one's sweet. nice too. The Houston one's nice too. Yeah. yeah. Yep. What were you gonna say, Andre? The Walgreens one isn't bad either. I like that hat. I think. <laughs> I think. No, I mean, I always say that because that's what it looks like. But yeah. I mean, that's you know, that's just it does. Like, but I think that that's a good looking hat, and I also feel like that patch just pops too. Uh, you know, it just looks it, it looks good. Like with that, I don't know, just like that diversity in the patch. I feel like. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, listen. I think these are pretty good. We can take them down, Leon, if you want. Let's see what I mean. Get out of here. Well, I'll ask one question for everybody. Um, and, and just an just honest assessment, like or opinion. Uh, what was better, uh, the red velvets last year or these? Mm. I think the red velvets. It's hard, right? Because there's just so many of these ones. There's 35. Yeah. Right. You're almost got to go one on one on one. I, I'd go. I listen. I would. I love these hats we just looked at. Yeah. Red velvets to me were stronger. Yeah, because there wasn't that. I many think the red velvets. velvets right? was nine. Go ahead. Uh, it might have. St- I don't know. The red velvets was more than nine. Okay. Maybe originally didn't they add some? Yeah. I don't remember. It, I think they that added one some. that one year feels like it's been five years. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, because I got mine first in January of last year. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then they did like another, like rerun of them. I think like around. F- like mid February, March, or something like that. We might have to. We might have to do another draft. Put them all in the pool. Yeah, we might have to do that. But I, I don't know. I, I love these though. These are these are yeah. these are really good hats, mm-hmm. man. The Padre. I think the pa- I, I don't know. I think that that Padres when they split the S and the D. Yeah, though. like I just kind of feel like the thing about last year's is there were more of like a everyday hat. 
where even though it was a Valentine's Day hat, it was still like you could wear that right. You know, well, I guess not right now, but you could wear that in June and that hat's going to look good. Mm -hmm. um, these ones kind of feel way more like themed, but yeah. I don't think that that's like a bad thing. You know what I mean? Like, I, I think like it's still even a wearable hat on an everyday basis. Um, just like, I don't know, though. It, it, there is a lot more, so it's hard to call it, but I like the Red Velvet. Red Velvets was one of my favorite um, releases from Hat Club, personally, mm. so. Yeah. But, I think these were good. I think you guys agree, right? Yeah. This is a good, good release. Yeah, I sure. think, um, so you guys got a preview of these. They're going to be dropping uh, tomorrow at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Yes, sir. Um, get your chance to kind of jump on these. Uh, and, you know, listen, I think it's always important going with a plan. Yep. And if you, uh, if you need, uh, if you need assistance with that, Leon and I did a, um, did a video on, on how to score on these, um, on these drops. And a lot of it comes down to being very planful, knowing For around sure. you, like what's going to sell fastest. And if that's the one you want, go after that first, you know, yeah. make sure you go for that first. And then yeah. go back in for seconds later, you know? Always have a backup plan, man. Don't go and just have your heart set on one. Get your heart set on like fives just in case, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. 35 like, different styles, though. Everybody should get at least something. Yeah, yeah. With that many different hats, there it's not. You should be. Which, which one do you think sells out first? I mean, that Yankees one? Nope. There'll no be, way. They'll be too they'll many. They'll have a lot. They'll have a lot. Of too many of them. They'll have a yank. Okay. There'll be too many of them. I think, of them. I the think Detroit so like, one. I think Detroit, Philly, uh, Cardinals. Cardinals. Uh, I think Chase those are, don't really hang out. Yeah, man. Don't, don't say either. the Phillies, man. Don't say that. <laughs> I'm trying to get that shit on points. Relax. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, listen, we'll Toronto find Angry Jay doesn't always hang out too long either that's a we'll find that we'll find out tomorrow right yeah. but i think it i think um there's gonna be i think you're right jason there's an awful lot of styles to choose from but we still see a lot of people miss even when there's a lot of styles to choose from because Agreed. that's why i think it's important to go in with a plan and if you're hearing like if you're hearing a lot of people on social media say god i, I gotta get my hands on this one or that one or this one or that right. one use some common sense and go for that one first you know yeah and just, or not at all well, if you want to, be, if you if you want to, if you're of the faint of heart, if you're the faint of heart, then yes, don't go and edit at, at all. But if you're gonna like take a risk, go after that one first. Then, yeah, you know. And the interesting thing is, we'll wrap up with this, right? It comes with a pin, so these are all fifty bucks a pop. So, mm -hmm. you know, whether you get if you just get one, it's okay to get one ring out real quick and go back for another one. You're not killing yourself with any shipping, really, because it's. Because right. it's free shipping still. So it's not the same as if it's 45 bucks and you're doing that five times. You're getting charged for shipping right. too. It's 50 bucks no matter what. So one at a time is okay too. You know, if you if that's your strategy. But Agreed. I, think, I think we'll leave it at that, right, guys? I think this was good. We got a good little preview in here. Um, nice people story. got a chance to see them. Um, we, we shared our opinions. I can't wait to see uh, um, how happy people are when they score tomorrow. And um, uh, I'll also, um, I'm not looking forward to seeing how unhappy people are if they miss. Um, but <laughs> that's how it works, right? Yeah. So, uh, guys, thanks again, Leon. You ready to take us away? Yeah. Make sure you guys like, rate, review, subscribe. Let us know in the comments which hats you guys are going for. Um, and until next time, we'll catch you guys soon. Stay fitted. We out. Peace. See you, everybody.